gonna ruin the whole explanation of Women's Day. But you know what? Let's do this. We all love our lovely public holiday Women's Day. Even though most people love it because it gives them a longer weekend or most people love it because they're doing the assignment that was due a week ago. Okay, but other people celebrate the significance of women in 1956 that began a march to the union building to fight against past laws. This day also celebrates the three women that formed the women organization called the Federation of South African Women to secure the equality of opportunities to all women. In today's world, we also celebrate the women that fight against our modern problems, which would be harassment or even GDV. That's a lot to take in. Even us individually celebrate Women's Day to celebrate the women in our lives that inspire us, which could be someone in our family or even celebrities. But today, I want to talk about the two women that inspire me to my day-to-day -day life, which would be my mother and my grandmother. Let's start way back when my grandmother, known as Tandiwe, was a young and bright woman, which she still is. Tandiwe, I mean Makulu, was a woman that grew up in a Christian household and was basically the mother of that household. My Makulu is a hardworking, loving, equal, and caring woman. Even when I try to help her, she always says that she'll take care of it. And trust me, I tried. She has helped a lot of people, and I mean a lot. Changed their life by a lot of cooking and praying. And trust me, those prayers, they hit hard. Now onto the woman that literally gave birth to me. The woman that without her decisions in life, I wouldn't be where I am today in my room, pretending it's a studio. But anyways, this woman is Kaya Gazidioka, my very own mother. My mother worked really hard to up her lifestyle in a township in Western Cape. She knew that whatever happens, she needs to focus on her books. And with all her hard work, it got me into this life and this lifestyle. My mother is also like my grandmother which is hardworking. My mother is an electrical engineer and is also the first South African head woman in a course called Women in Power in an international organization called SACRI. My mother also thrives to help other women in engineering to have a spot on the stage and to also let their opinions about engineering be heard. Anyways, from all of this, she still cooks and takes care of us at home. I wouldn't even survive a day in her shoes but that's my goal even though she has mother duties she is still the inspiration to women that studied or are still studying electrical engineering in my opinion women's day isn't just a holiday it's a day where we take time from our busy lives to celebrate the women in the past and around us that led and changed our lives to be better although it's just one single day why don't we celebrate the women in our lives at least once a month to give them the thrones that they need to sit on. Nevertheless, I hope this touched someone's life and gave a clear explanation of what Women's Day is. <laughs>